Everyone loves to see this. Buddha. And this. It may look easy. Athletes posing for the camera, wearing their medals. But rarely do people go behind the scenes to see the real tears, the real sweat. The real work. What's your favorite other sport to play outside of track? All right, what do you got? What's your favorite sport to play outside of track? Basketball. Oh yeah, what you got? What would you like to say to your friends, followers, and supporters? Thank you for following along with the whole process and supporting me that whole time. Okay. I was gonna say the same thing. Okay, anything else you want to add? Really? Yeah. Not, not anything? No, that's it. That's it. Okay, so describe your first success, like the first time that you won like a first place medal at a meet. Tell me about that. Um, it was the shot put, and I think I threw like 14 feet, and I got like first place. And how'd that make you feel? I was happy because I was new at it, and it just gave me confidence. Okay. What about you? Mine was either long jump or the 800. Okay. Then tell me about that. Uh, it was, I was scared at first, but then when I finished it, I wasn't scared. And how did it make you feel? Okay. Good. So do you have any secret talents? I'm good at hair, and I give the best advice. Okay. Anything else? What about you? What's your secret talent? That's impressive. You should be proud of yourself. I am. I'm proud of you. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. Gabby, what do you do before a meet to calm your butterfly? I take deep breaths and I just focus on my running and my stretching before the race. Okay, wonderful answer. And Jimmy, what about you? How do you calm your butterflies before a meet? Uh, I like don't focus on it that much. Mm -hmm. I don't overthink it. And when, like when I'm running, then I'm good. Okay, awesome. Gabrielle. What are some of the things that you give up to play competitive sports? I'd say like unhealthy snacks and like fast food and like sodas, but also school events sometimes and wanting to hang out with friends. Sometimes I can't because I have sports that day. All um, right. And Jimmy, what about you? Uh, vacations, playing with my friends, and playing on my phone. Okay, great answers. Thank you so much. Gabby, what are some of your favorite destinations to visit? I'd say Morocco, Colombia, Panama, and Barbados. Oh, nice. What about you, Jimmy? Where do you like to visit? Morocco, Panama, and Colombia, and Barbados. And Nigeria's next. Do you think the life of an athlete is tough compared to non-athletes? Um, yes and no, because I've had people heckle me, like parents heckle me because of my height and because I'm bigger than everybody else in basketball. But also, I have to watch my diet and I have to maintain my diet. And it's just, you know, because if I don't, then I could be out of shape and it's going to affect my running. How about you, Jimmy? Yes, because... Yes, yes because, um... You have to eat right, and you have to run, and some people aren't used to running, like hard. 
and also some people could yell at you and uh, uh, you have to train really hard and it's very hard to do it. How does athletics make you a better student? It holds me accountable because I have to have certain grades to play sports, but also it teaches me stuff in life and the scholarships that I, if I do good now, then I can get scholarships when I'm older and it will get me to my dream college, LSU. Uh, well, it helps your mental, it helps you get mentally stronger, and that's it. Gabrielle, what qualities do you think would make a good teammate or a good captain? Leadership and the effort that you put into the sport, but also your like participation. All right, and Jimmy, what qualities do you think would make a good teammate or a good captain? Uh, don't yell at people if they're having a hard time with the drills. Talk to them calmly and um, help them with something if they need help with it. Thank you, great answers, guys. What do you guys like about GP Storm? I like how they're not just here for our potential and talent, that they're here to make us better people and make sure that we're also doing good in school. What about you, Jim Jim? Uh, they make us work to our highest potential, but they also care about us at the same time. All right, so who's your favorite coach on GP Storm? Nah, this is set up.